If you try to play by your own rules, you won't win the game. <clears throat> um, welcome to another episode of Self-Employed Success Secrets. Monday edition on today's episode, we're gonna talk about a lot. Okay, we're gonna talk about getting to heaven, okay? Getting to business heaven. You get to heaven by trusting the Lord on this earth, but if you wanna to get to heaven, have the business you want, these 11 tips. Also too, stay tuned for the very end for a surprise. So what are these 11 tips, okay? And also too, it be it might be helpful to memorize these and think about them when you're working with the clients, okay? And try to reinforce and hammer them down as accurately and as effectively as you possibly can. And you, things will get better and open up for your business. A lot of businesses are in hell right now. They're in a bad place. And as the saying goes, it's hell to get out of hell, okay? So let's go through these 11, okay? The first, and we talked about this in two of the videos. You'll see the videos on the screen. This is a comprehensive compendium on this video okay these are the 11 things that are you gotta be first class okay this means be the if if all the businesses in the world that do what you do are sitting in a classroom you need to be at the top of your class okay first class so the next is full do a complete job do everything from a to z next one is be fast okay get get work done quickly and well Next is fun, make it fun, bring joy, bring laughter, bring levity. Next is fresh, keep things updated, Can continually try to get better. Okay, first class, fast, full, fine, fresh. Next is friendly, okay, be nice to people, be kind, be considerate, be generous, okay. Next is be fantastic, be worthy of other people's talking about your business to other people. Okay, now the next part are the four C's, okay? You're gonna wanna be communicative. Think about when you go to a restaurant, look at the menu, it describes everything. Do you want a medium, do you want a large, do you want a small? Okay, do you want a drink, do you want ice in it, all that stuff. Be communicative, make it convenient, make it easy for them. And usually your hardship is somebody else's convenience. Okay, so communicative, convenient, cost effective, okay? It's gotta be at a price they can afford. Most people are not rich. Most people don't have a very high elasticity. Okay, they can't pay a ton of money. All right, the next is be consistent. Do it all the time. Do it all the time. Do it all the time. The same way all the time. Be robotic. Let me talk about this. We've talked about this on previous videos. If you do these 11 things, your, your business will go up. Okay, if you're first class, fast, full, fun, fresh, friendly, fantastic, communicative, cost-effective, convenient, all consistent, all those things, okay? Communicative, do all of these 11 things. And also to an added one is be creative. This will help you on your journey, okay? All right, all right, now why should you care? You should care because your life will get easier if you do these things. <clears throat> There's a lot of people who are gonna spend a lot of time trying to, they're gonna figure these things out on their own. That list did not come from a book that was read. It came from just anecdotal evidence and observations and putting and stitching things together personally. Okay, as Jim Rohn said, he's the famous personal development guru. He said that personal formal education will make you a living, but self-education will make you a fortune. These things came together to help you, okay? There's just 11 of them. You can hold 11 things in your head, okay? But this is gonna make it smooth sailing. Just imagine a snowboarder going down a, a hill. That's what's gonna happen if you just listen to these and embody these traits, embody these 11 to get to heaven, okay? All right, now the conclusion, the main point of this video is that if you want an easier life experience, you want your business to run much smoother than it probably has in the past, apply these 11 okay remember you're either going to be rich or you're going to be right okay you either get the results you want or you get to feel good you get to one up somebody else okay follow these 11 to get that business head now this leads to today's surprise which is the body wants comfort but the soul wants growth okay hopefully this message was able to feed your soul okay knowing that your business success is in your hands okay where your business is a year from now two years from now is going to have a lot to do with these 11 things we just asked do these 11 things 
when you're talking with people, when you're selling your services to people, talk, think about these 11 things in your mind. Am I being first class? Am I being communicative? Am I describing fully what's going on? Is it cost effective? And it's just 11. Anybody can keep a, a number, a table of 11 in their mind, okay? And this leads to our last point. Lastly, is always unsuccessful people. They make decisions based on their current situation, but successful people, you hopefully make decisions based on where you want to be, okay? Do these 11, embody these 11 traits. Your services should embody these 11 traits if you want to get to heaven. Follow these 11 to get to heaven.